Um, another. No, no. What's up, best friends? It's your girl Danielle, and I'm back with a new video. There's 10 days left till Christmas, and I know all you guys. You guys didn't even do your Christmas shopping yet. I just know you haven't. I do it by the title today. I will be giving you guys more than a hundred gift ideas to get for your friends, your family, and like your secret Santa that you're not really friends with, but you pulled their name and now you have to get them something. I got you. I put my list of gifts into different categories. They'll be listed right here. If you just want to skip to that specific category, just go to the description box down below and I'll put time stamps for each category. The first category we'll be talking about is room decor or like room vibes. This is like gifts you can give someone to just amp up their room and help them out with decoration. The first gift is a projector or a room light that shines like a sunset on their wall. I feel like it really helps with the aesthetic and just the overall vibe of the room. The next one is a candle. You can never go wrong with candle, literally. So many small businesses right now are selling candles and you can just help a small business out. And if you're planning on buying a candle, you might as well just buy a candle lighter or a candle wick trimmer. The next one is a silk pillowcase. Silk pillowcases are really good for your hair and your acne. The next gift is an air diffuser. Do you that air diffuser is what's happening with the candle? No. Mm. Um, if you want to be bougie and fancy, you can just opt out for an air diffuser. The next one is a record player. And if you're going to get someone a record player, you might as well get them some vinyls, other favorite songs. Once again, that's kind of expensive. You got to work within your budget, obviously. The next gift is Funko Pops. I know some people look at Funko Pops as just like a random toy, but I know there's some people out there who really just like the vibe. And honestly, every time someone has given me a Funko Pop, I have been really happy with the gift and I actually put it on my bookshelves and it's just like a cute way, especially for people who are like fans of specific TV shows or movies or- you're a nerd. The next one would be a weighted blanket. Apparently weighted blankets are really good, especially for people who find it difficult to fall asleep. You can get someone a wool cute blanket or like one of those throw blankets that are really cute. You can get someone a desk mirror. Like I've seen like heart shaped ones or like cool shaped ones. Or get the ones with the lights on it, sorry. Wall mirror. Once again, you have to feed into the aesthetic of the person you're buying for. So the next category we have is fashion. I feel like right now we're in a state and society where everyone's just into fashion right now just trying to amp up their game so i feel like now is a perfect time to give someone something they've always wanted or just something to like help them out a little bit so the first gift is shoes you can never go wrong with shoes i feel like if you are to buy someone a pair of shoes make sure it's something that they would like you just have to really work into once again the aesthetic of the person you're buying for or help them step out of it oh Okay, so the next gift would be Crocs. You can get them to just a classic Croc or like even the ones with the fur inside. And if you want to even go the extra mile, you can add gibbets onto them. I know a lot of small businesses are doing like cute custom gibbets. You can get someone slides. I feel like slides or home slippers. You can get someone boots if you live in a place where it snows. You can get someone like Doc Martens, Doc Martens or actual winter boots. You can get someone a Telfer bag or even a baguette bag. Just a little cute purse. Like, baguette. 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 Purse? Baguette. Baguette. You like a cute statement piece. Um, you can get ba baguette bags in different colors as well. Or textures. Ooh, textures. So yeah, like, crocodile style. Yeah, so like crocodile skin or like furry. Like, like stuff out of your comfort zone a little bit. You know? I have to meet with them. Both. Um, you can also get someone a robe. I've never seen someone upset on a robe. I feel like you just feel so powerful in a robe, honestly. Bougie. bougie. You're feeling bougie, you're feeling stylish. Um, another. No, no. As I put this back, another gift you can get someone is sunglasses. Sunglasses are such a great accessory item. You can also get them a sweater vest. I feel like sweater vests right now are really in. You can get them silk pajama sets. You can get them fuzzy socks. I feel like every year people are like, give me fuzzy socks, give me fuzzy socks. 
You can get some on fuzzy socks. You can get some on jewelry. You just have to know if they're silver or gold per se. Once you get that information, you can totally work around it. Get some rings, necklaces, earrings, anything to amp up their style. You can get them claw clips. Right now, everyone's trying to clip up their hair or do different hairstyles. You can get them a baseball cap or even a beanie. You can get them a cute scarf. You can also get them a bucket hat. I feel like bucket hats are kind of in. Like the fluffy ones, just cute ones. You can get them cool pants. And last but not least, you can get them a winter jacket if you live in the cold, or if you don't have the money for a winter jacket, you can get them like a puffer jacket or even like a puffer vest. Those are pretty in as well. The next category is technology and accessories. So the first item is a Canon camera. Some good cameras to get is this camera right here. I'm using a Canon. G7X, but I also know the Canon M50 is like another classic camera that a lot of people use. If you're gonna get someone a camera, or if you know someone who really likes filming like TikToks or other videos, you can get them a ring light, a tripod, and extra batteries. Those come in handy. Shout out to Sabrina and Julian. You're using your light. Another gift you can get them is a phone case. So right now I have this brown heart one, but you can get them anything based off their favorite color or their favorite pattern. This person likes traveling or going to the beach or their friends. You can never go wrong with speaker. You can also get them a waterproof speaker as well for like the shower or even once again the beach. You can get them a disposal camera or you can even get them like the IMAX Polaroid camera or even the printable scan like you just connect it to your phone and it prints it out for you. If you're gonna get someone one of those cameras or even the printable ones, maybe even think about adding on some film. I feel like those two gets together would be a great bundle. You can get this person a Bluetooth keyboard. I've seen these cute keyboards on TikTok a lot and I just feel like they will be really aesthetic to put in their room and like I feel like it would just be aesthetic to like hear the clicks when you type as well. It depends on what laptop they use, but you can also get them like a laptop stand that they can just put their laptop on. Depending on the person, you can get them an Apple Watch or a Fitbit. I feel like those are also good gifts as well. You can get someone a new gaming controller, add on to their collection, or even like I've seen these cute like gaming controller holders. Like I've seen this little Sonic the Hedgehog holding a gaming controller. You can get someone a Nintendo Switch. That's like on the more, um, if this person already has a Switch, you can get them maybe some switch accessories, like travel cases. You can get this person a karaoke microphone, like the Bluetooth one you can connect to your phone and just, you can get them an Alexa or a Google. Those are very handy. Okay, so we're just gonna move on to the next category. The next category is beauty. So you can never go wrong with getting someone lip gloss, especially if this person wants to explore different lip gloss options. Sets from Sephora, I feel like are a lot better than sets from other places. You can get this person lashes, you can get this person a gua sha or a, um, a face roller. Make sure this person doesn't already have it because I feel like a lot of people have face rollers and gua shas. You can get this person a face mask or even a lip mask or an under eye mask. Just the whole set, just a whole bundle. You can get this person a bath bomb if this person likes taking baths. If this person likes to travel, you can get them a makeup bag, body scrub, perfume. Acne patches could be a good idea as well, along with ordinary serums. Okay, so we're just gonna move on to the next category. The next category is fitness. So these next gifts are catered to those who are really into their fitness or even love working out. So the first gift would be a nice gym set. When you're comfortable with what you're wearing in the gym, it just makes it a lot easier to work out. You can get them headphones, like Beats ones, or even AirPods. Wireless earbuds that go around your ears and you feel like even though, don't get this for someone who like, for the workout category, but wired headphones are underrated. You can get them weights for their ankles, um, one of those roll, um, the only reason I'm saying you can get them one of the roll, the foam rollers, because I gave um, my best friend Sabrina one for her birthday, and I just want to feel like I'm a good gift giver. Or even buy them a yoga mat. We're just going to go to the next category, which is self-help. One thing you can get someone is a journal. So they can write down all the wrong places that went on life that led them to this point right now. But if you're gonna get someone a, a journal, just often some pens. You can get them some, some Muji pens. I will always ride or die for Muji pens. Uh, you can get this person an agenda if you feel like they need to really organize their life. You can also get them a gallon water bottle. So you're really forcing them to drink water. Blue light glasses. I feel like blue light glasses. I heard that blue light glasses don't really be doing that much, but at the same time, they're cute. So I'm like. 
Okay, so the next category is just kitchen appliances. I used to work at a kitchen retail store and during the holiday season, I kid you not, everyone used to ask for milk frothers, the double wall mugs, um, and an air fryer. But make sure they have space because it'd be taking up a lot of space. Something you can also get someone is a reusable straw or like even reusable bubble tea straws. You can also get them a customized mug. And if they're a tea drinker, you can get them like a tea box organizer or just like a, a bunch of different teas, like a tea collection type of thing. So the next category is car accessories. Hear me out, right? Don't act like you're the driver friend. I know you're not. I feel like we all have one friend or a couple of friends that are, are typically the drivers of the group. I feel like it'd be nice to just amp up their car style a little bit. Respectfully though, in the most utmost respect. You can get them stuff like, one thing you can get them is a car air, air freshener. Car freshener. You can get them a gas gift card. You can get them one of those globs that like sticks onto the cup holders or even like the air conditioning just to clean it out. You can get them one of those cleaning globs. You can get them LED lights. It depends on the person, but you can get them LED lights for the bottom of their, like where their feet goes. You can get them a bobblehead. Once again, if they're really into like a specific thing, you can get a bobblehead catered to that. You can get them a steering wheel cover or even like one of those headrest pillows. You can get them one of those garbages that you hang on the back of the seats. So the next category is experiences or quality time. So the next category is memberships. Um, yeah, if you if you enjoy this video, please give this video a thumbs up. It helps with the video. Currently two videos on the screen right now. My last video and a random video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the third day of 12 days of Christmas.